Todd, when we read about these discoveries, and no doubt there's going to be the next one will come out in a, in a, in a newspaper soon, how does the average person read that and understand? Are we talking about a humankind or are we talking about another kind? Now, having uh, studied these issues for years that I've worked on this problem, I'm really confident that whatever the next one is, it's going to fall either into the ape camp or in the human camp. I don't think it's as easy as just, you know, reading a magazine or looking at, looking at a picture and being able to say, oh yeah, that's human, no, yeah, that's not. Uh, I think there's a lot more variety of human out there than what we have really been thinking about, kind of like with cats and all the other created kinds. We've had a very limited idea of the sorts of varieties there are. So yeah, don't panic, be patient, let science do its thing, let creation science do its thing, and hopefully we'll be able to give a pretty timely update on what is or isn't human. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.